Okay, so here we have a load of images listed 1 to 30. Now, all of these different images and all of these different numbers equal a different update from the very first one to the very latest one. And as you can also see, we have an amazing tier, a good tier, an okay tier, a meh and an awful. And as you can see here, we have all of the different updates that are listed on the tier list. Although with two quick disclaimers. The first one being these ones with that image are literally just a blank white number. As you can see here, and uh, by the way, <laughs> the 12 was deliberately off center just to annoy people. The second disclaimer being that some of the updates that have been released are not in this video, otherwise we would be here for absolutely ages. So I've decided to keep the more relevant ones and leave the more useless ones out of here. But if you do enjoy this video, then please do make sure to go leave a comment down below, like, subscribe, it'd be really appreciated, and uh, let's let's head on right into this. Okay, so first up, as you can see that we have number one right here, and uh, the background images are actually just the images from the update. So if we head over to Discord, as you can see, this is the exact same image. It's pretty cool. I know, I'm so, so smart. Kind of. Now we have to try and think of which tier or which like level I suppose uh, this this first update should go into. Okay, so for this one, this buffed the team gen spawn rate. And just for those that don't know, uh, nerfing makes something weaker and buffing makes something stronger. So basically, what they've done here is they've made the team gen spawn rate uh, a bit faster, a bit stronger. Updated maps to have fewer void gaps. That's pretty helpful. I quite like that. Knocking someone into the void now counts as a kill. That is also very useful. Now again, this is one of the first updates. You know, one of the really early update so we're just gonna put this into meh tier it's all right it added a few cool things they're just basic now okay so scrolling down to the second one here added an emerald sword emerald armor a sand temple map re-enabled slowness while aiming bows okay all right improved anti-cheat and disabled dropping swords i don't know you could do that in the past okay so the emerald armor and emerald sword they're really cool they're really helpful and uh, they're more late games you know it, it kind of affects that bit quite a bit the anti-cheat really doesn't do much like their anti-cheat is really really bad but literally just because they added the emerald sword and armor i'm gonna pop number two update the second update into the okay tier it's okay it's quite cool it's good for end game i'm also somehow typing on that can i Ooh. and uh moving swiftly onwards to the third one okay so this update was actually really cool by the looks of things we've got added kits so this is the first time the kits had a, a thing in the game so this included the builder kit the barbarian kit the farmer kit so again these are really the early kits they were kind of testing the waters with this one uh, but I think, you know, kits, they've, they've impacted the game quite a lot. So that's something to keep in mind. 16 versus 16 limited mode. Those are so good. Uh, those are now 30 v 30s, but it used to be 16 v 16s. Buffed obsidian. So they made the obsidian stronger, I'm guessing. Yep. Just had to check that. And, uh, increased bed destroy time from, uh, 19 minutes to 21 minutes. So like how long it takes for the, the game to just destroy your bed. Okay. So this is fairly similar to the second one. They've impacted the game quite a bit with like new armor for this one and like new, new swords and stuff. And because kits are such a big part, we're going to pop this one into the okay tier as well, but we're going to put it at the very top of the okay tier because that's, that's pretty cool. Okay, so here it looks like they're, they're just adding more kits every time at this point. The baker kit has access to health gain, or gain health, I would put that, through apples and speed boost pies. Basically, they added the baker kit. And there's a new free kit rotation. So basically, every single update, we normally have, like, an, a rotation of uh, free kits for the week. So for this one, they put uh, Farmer Cletus and the Barbarian kit. Now, they didn't really have too many OP kits at the time, so I, I guess that was pretty good apparently there was an issue with the full damage i don't even think i was playing at this time still so you know we're, we're going with that apparently that's changed okay although this one uh, did add the did add the new uh, like kit rotation thing it's a new it's not very new anymore is it y yeah that's uh <laughs> that's not new that's no in it oh hello I'm gonna have to put this into maybe meh. We'll put it. We'll put it last in meh. Is what we'll do. It's like it's, it's it's okay. It's not awful. For this update, we have the new archer kit. That one is pretty good. I have used the archer kit previously. I don't own it, but it's definitely good. I don't think I own it. I'm not sure. I can't remember. They've added seven new maps. That is a lot of new maps. It doesn't tell us what new maps but they're new. Added a monthly wins leaderboard, added damage indicators, and uh, buff the barbarian kit. Gain rage on kill, reduce diamond slash emerald cost. Okay, so they just made the barbarian kit absolutely amazing, which is why you saw those massive influx of uh, videos on why the barbarian kit's so good. And uh, apparently better spectating. Don't know what that means, but we'll go with it. Okay, so I'm going to say meh again, but I'm going to put it above number one because I feel like it's better than the first update. 
because uh, we've got like seven new maps, but it's nothing good. It's nothing special. This is still early updates, okay? All right, well, for this update, we have new zip lines. I used them a few times before. Not too much, but I have. We got the Inferno Shielder kit. Barbarian now has a unique Rage Blade. Okay, so this is probably when you saw the massive influx of new videos about how good it is. And they nerfed the Archer kit, so they made it a bit worse. Okay, this is, this is purely... Purely because of the Rage Blade. The Rage Blade is genuinely insane and they added more maps the next day, which I'm going to include in the same update. Uh, I'm going to put this in OK. It's going to go the very bottom or the very back of OK. Uh, hopefully we can start filling up some of these eventually. Okay, so this update doesn't look too good. Uh, autumn doubles and airship squads. That's it. And there is a higher chance of queuing into new maps for the next few days. You know how I said I'm going to fill up some other ones? Now's the time. That is that is not good. That's going an awful, I'm afraid. Moving on to number eight. It looks like we have a few more things here. I haven't read them yet, so I don't know. They added the Melody Kit. Ring kit rotation is Archer and Builder for that week. Added Campsite map to the 16v16 mode. Added a Pinefall map in doubles and squads. Okay, so this one, again, it's pretty bad. It is pretty bad. This must have been a very... Very bad few weeks for content creators. But it's not as bad as number seven. So we're going to put it just ahead of number seven. Doesn't quite reach meh. What are we on? What are we on? Number nine? Is this nine? I can't remember. Pirate Davy Kit. Okay, use a TNT cannon to bombard your enemies. And in bold limited time item of balloons. There's no way they're limited. They're still in the game. <laughs> they're still in the game. When was this? This was July 19th. Well, I wouldn't really call that, you know, limited, but... <laughs> Balloon tips, you can drop TNT from the sky. Oh, they included a little tip. They included some tips in the in the update log. Added solo queue. Did you not have solos before this? I, okay. All right, now this one's going to be quite controversial, but because they added the solo thing, I think that's what it means. It's going to go in good for me. I practically only play solos when I'm not with anyone. Like I won't go into random duos or something. So I'm gonna go for I'm gonna go for good. Okay, I think that's pretty good, right? Moving on, we have added match uh hate HUD HUD added match HUD. We got a match timer, that's good, and a kill count and bed indicators. So these are the bed indicators. Basically, it has the cross if you don't, if that team doesn't have the bed. Uh we have the kill count and we also had some uh some what's that called the timer <laughs> and they updated the lobby stats board so nothing special but they've changed the the model basically of the leaderboards so it hasn't changed much but we have got some useful things like with the hud with the uis uh so we'll put it here we'll put it here i think might not quite deserve that it might be there but we'll go with it i've also said we'll go with it like a couple hundred times in this video but We'll go with it. <laughs> Next up, we have some uh, new Elder Tree kit. That was the first kit that I ever bought. And I bought it when that update came out for the video. And we have a new map in squads, which is called Factory. I don't even remember that map, I'm not gonna lie. And free kits of the week, Infernal Shielder and Builder. I really don't know what that kit is. Give me a second. Okay, here we go. Let's go into the kit, uh, Inferno. Is it this? Oh. It's born with a massive shield that can deflect damage. Oh, it's that kit. Right, this one, pretty useless. Okay, it's not as useless as these two here, but we're, uh, top of awful. Okay, so uh, what they did is they changed the cost from uh, four animals down to 90 iron for a singular fireball. Which is pretty good. I wouldn't pay four emeralds for that. It's not that good. They reduced the explosion radius? Explosion radius? Okay. And they reduced the damage by 50%. And reduced flight speed by 10%. Sheesh. That was a big boy nerf moment. And for explosives, they reduced the TNT and fireball knockback for players farther, farther, farther away. I think it's meant to say further away. And now just because of this, we're going to move this one. Oh, and uh, yeah, this is update 12. This is the one where I deliberately moved the number off to the side just to annoy people. You're very welcome. Anytime. So yeah, we, we, we've moved that one up there and we're going to move 12 to the top of Awful instead. All right, so uh, next up we have number 13. This is the first one that they made a proper logo change, actually, which is pretty cool. Custom matches. Custom matches. Custom. Custom matches. Oh my god. Custom matches, you can have access to configuring the game type and map. You also get a mm. <laughs> You also get a join code to share with friends. Custom matches are free as well. <laughs> Alright, just because of the custom matches, okay? Just because of that, it's going straight to good. 
Okay, or maybe even all- is it- is it amazing? Right, it might get knocked down later, but we'll go with amazing, because custom matches genuinely- they've changed everything. Tab list, we've added a new in-game tab list that lets you quickly glance over the state of the match, see players- see each player's kit? Ah, they removed that. I remember that update, they removed it, because that was awful. They added six maps, bug fixes, and uh, full patch notes are in the Discord, apparently. Uh, we don't really need to look at those, because it's just going to be, like, what bugs they fixed. Uh, but yeah, this update, it was not good. We, we got six maps, yay. Yeah, if we go here, this is... Was it as bad as 12? What was 12? Yeah, this was worse than 12. So, we're gonna pop it. We'll pop it, we'll pop it just behind 12. Or like, well, uh, looks like we have 15 next, which uh, they changed the logo again. Is that a logo? It might not be. Added the wizard kit. <laughs> Couldn't tell. Using magical stuff to cast lightning strikes and electricity bulbs. <laughs> I'm so bad. Three kits of the week. We got Lassie and we got Baker. Uh, I'm guessing I skipped the update where they added Lassie because I didn't see that. And the new map of Checkmate is uh, squads, I guess. Reduce client lag from damage highlight effects. Lag equals bad. This is going in okay. All right, we'll put it. Uh, that one was charge shield. Yeah, we'll put it there. It's at the back of good. Or is that okay? That's okay. It's at the back of okay. <laughs> Content updates are being moved from Monday to Friday. That means uh, the next major update will come out in a few days. So we got the Vulcan kit. Uh, use a high-tech tablet to control camera turrets across the entire map. It didn't say entire, did it? Nope, okay. 30v30 LTM. Teams of 30 plus uh, increased generator drop speed. Uh, pure chaos. Okay, so this is when they added the 30v30 LCM thing, or is it? Or increased generator drops it? I don't know. We've got 30v30, okay? It's been replaced with uh, 16v16, I'm guessing. Okay, pretty useless, but the Vulcan kit is pretty cool. So, I'm gonna go with... Uh, meh. Meh. Yeah. Okay, so, uh, looks like, uh, we've got a good update. Season 1 Battle Pass is live! Okay, I remember everybody freaking out about this. This... This changed everything. This was so cool, okay? Unlocked five new kits in the battle pass, including Pyro, uh, Raven, Beekeeper, Jade, and Warrior. New locker system unlocked 23 sprays, 27 lobby titles, and five final kill effects. And daily and weekly missions. This update, everybody loved. Right, this one is being pushed up straight to amazing. Uh, that'll, that, the uh, top of good, okay? Oh, and just, uh, just in case that didn't annoy you enough, um, trust me. I made these in Photoshop. This is one pixel to the left, okay? <laughs> it's not centered. It's one pixel to the left. Okay, so this one, uh, they fixed the beekeeper kit spawning too many emeralds. What a shame. <laughs> Buffed raven uh, poison tick damage from five regular damage to three true damage. Jade now respawns with her hammer. Ooh. So it's like armor, you respawn with it. Okay, so this one wasn't like absolutely insane, but it was definitely good with the beekeeper being buffed a bit. Or is it nerfed? I can't remember. <laughs> Smash it in the middle of, of here, okay? It'll be like roughly around meh. Oh, and by the way, if you're enjoying this video so far, please make sure to smash that like button, subscribe, and uh, go, go check the links in the descriptions. So they're all pretty cool, okay? New update is live, Bounty Hunter kit. That's, that's cool, I like that. The Jules LTM mode, the Jules 2v2 LTM mode. Insane. I used it throughout my entire 12-hour video that I did. Uh, go check that out if you want to. It's so good. So easy for XP and wins. It's it's mental. This update also remember because it gives the knockback baguette. Yes. Genuinely, this, this was a masterpiece. This update was amazing. We also have seven new maps. The anti-cheat improvements. Again, they're back, but with, with no effect at all. I'm sorry, but this, this update was just great. This is... It'll be behind that one, okay? Because that, br that brought us the battle pass. This brought us some cool stuff, alright? Bounty Hunter, a uh, new and improved skin model. Okay, cool. Fixed bounty target not clearing when they become a spectator. And for the Vulcan kit, they fixed not being able to break turrets. Okay. Right, we'll put it- we'll put it at the top of good. Okay, that's where we'll- can I- Thank you. <laughs> Double XP weekend. This is actually one of the first ones that we actually got as well. This was pretty cool. Five new maps. Cool. Balloon nerfs. Cool. Weekly free rotation, Barbarian, Internal Shielder, and Baker. Cool. Uh, we'll put it at the... Mm, it'll go there. Uh, new item, we got the Tesla Coil Traps. Those are pretty cool. They're really annoying, but they're pretty cool. Balloon changes. <laughs> Doesn't describe what, but okay. Free kits, Elder Tree, Melody, and Builder. Right, I'm putting this one on the top of meh. Alright, we're adding a lot to the meh. Maybe we should put it good. 
It'll go at the back of good, okay? We've got to even this out a little bit. Look at all this, okay? <laughs> See, here they were really trying to get people to the end of that battle pass. They got some free 20% XP boost. I haven't actually done that yet. <laughs> you can now verify your Discord account for free 20 XP boost. Whoop, whoop. Or 20% XP boost, you get 20% more XP. It's nothing special. We'll go... Oh, uh, mm, uh, we'll put it... We'll put it there. New kit! We got Trinity. Massive increase of XP gains on XP gains. And they also added buffs to the Beekeeper and the Baker kit. Nice, I guess. Okay, so they made the Beekeeper and uh, the Baker a bit better, I'm guessing. Grim Reaper nerfs? No! I genuinely don't know where to put this one. Uh, We'll put it above number 9. Okay, so another new logo change. You can now gift kits to your friends. Whoa! They fixed the bow slowness glitch. Apparently there was a glitch for that. Didn't know that. And they also fixed the uh, Infernal Shielder Infinite Protection glitch. <laughs> Good. Fix being able to stack more than six balloons. Fix Archer having both a crossbow and tactical crossbow at once. So it can only have one. One of them. Right, this one has a lot of just fixing. It's, it's nothing special. It's not as bad as number 16, apparently. Don't remember which one that was. <laughs> oh, here we go, dodo birds. Flocks of dodo birds have been spotted inside bedwells. We're not sure what they're doing here. Anyway, barbarian visual rework. Nice double XP weekend. Cool. And uh, free kits of archer, melody, and barbarian quality of life changes. Quality of life changes. That's quite dramatic. Genuinely, Adding dodos was so fun. They've reduced how much they spawn now. That they were so fun. Well, that uh, mid good, mid good. We'll put that. Yeah, that'll do. Okay, so next up we have Lucky Block. Lucky Block LTM free kits, farmer, a builder, and lassie. Okay, so mm, no, more free kits. We got some custom match commands. I've never actually used them. But I know a lot of people that have, and they're really fun to play with. Oh, they also made the dodo birds worse because they were genuinely OP for a bit. I mean, they're still pretty good now, but like, you know, it, it's pretty good. We'll put it, we'll put it, good. Eh, that'll do. All right, moving on. We now have a double XP is enabled. They just doubled the XP for a bit, or <laughs> pyro buffs makes them stronger. Makes them stronger. Makes them stronger. Okay, so they made Raven and uh, Pyro a bit better, which is good. New lucky block item. That's cool. I I don't know what it was at the time. They had three new maps, uh, three kits. Uh, you can read those. <laughs> Reduce leather armor costs from 60 iron to 50 iron. Don't know where this should go. I reckon. It, uh, I reckon good. They've had a lot, a lot of stuff. We got some new maps. Okay. Got some buffs. We got some double XP. I'll put that in good. All right. Yeah. Good. We'll put it above. We'll put it above 25. Okay. We got a lot of 20s in this section. Okay. Hey Siri. Why do I take so long to record videos? Check it out. Yeah, I will do. No, I don't want free Apple support. I'm okay, thank you. Okay, so last but not least. Oh, oh yeah, I did add this as a note just that I remembered to say that. Yeah. Season 2 is live. We got five. That's four. We got five new Battle Pass kits. We got an item shop expansion so that they changed the UI of it. We got some potions. We got some diamond generator upgrades. We got 21 new sprays. We got 24 new lobby titles, new maps. Halloween lobby. That looks pretty cool. This, that, that's, that's cool, okay. Huge cheetah ban wave, they were not kidding. Oh, and when I say, uh, they were not kidding, they banned 20,342 people. Individual accounts. Alright, I'm genuinely thinking these, these, these battle pass updates, they, they're getting better and better. It's going above the last, of season one. Maybe, oh, will it go below? All right, well, there is, there's my tier list. There's my tier list on, uh, like, all the all, all the updates, okay? That's that's my opinion, okay? But yeah, if you did enjoy, please make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, comment down below, go check the links out in the description, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.